All right, so let's talk about the close method. Close is the final um, of the three methods that we're going to talk about. And it's basically uh, the method that we can use to terminate our generator. OK, so all future values are discarded. As soon as the close method is invoked, um, a message is sent to the generator and the generator needs to handle that message in order to terminate. Now, um, importantly, the close method is equivalent to throwing a generator exit error. OK, so if we don't handle that um, error and uh, we either ignore it because we capture it and we ignore it or we don't capture it, the um, generator will simply um, end with a uh, exception, right, with a um, crash. But we can simply handle that in a try accept block and return and finish our generator. So here is an example. It is the same um, example that we had in the previous video, but we uh, have modified it to manage generator exits, right? So we are generating um, 100 numbers from 1 to 10. We are yielding those numbers until we receive a generator exit, at which point we simply print out a message and return. Okay, so we are closing the generator. And in order to call that, um, we have a for loop, which uh, takes all the numbers generated by the, our generator. And if it reaches a number five, then we are calling gen.close. All right, so let's put that in our code. Now, the code is very similar to the one that we had in the previous video. So I'm simply going to copy it from here and paste it in our code. And we're just going to modify it slightly. So first of all, I want to handle the exit um, situation in our generator. So I'm going to catch here exceptions generator exit. OK, so in this case, I'm going to print a message generator exit and I'm going to return. And in our main program, instead of saying gen dot throw, I'm going to say gen dot close. OK, so I'm closing the generator if we receive a number five. All right, so that is basically it. That is how we handle the exit. Let's go ahead and run our program. Apparently, the first number that was generated was number five. Let's try that again. There we go. So we are generating a bunch of numbers. And at some point, we are receiving a generator exit. Um, I would like to actually move this print line up before the check, OK, just to see that the number five was indeed generated. So let's go ahead and run this program again. There we go. So we have about 13 numbers and the 13 number is five, which has thrown a gen.close error and has um, arrived here, has been caught and will return and finish the generator. So that is basically how the gen.close works.